<laughs> Zit mijn make-up. Hey guys, welcome to another video with Champ. Uh, in the last video I was working a little bit of the beginning with doing these kind of things. As I mentioned before, I have done some of these things, but I've also kind of trying to learn from other people. But from now on, we're also going to do a bit more in my own words. So I really like to work in a positive way, rewarding them for the good, letting them like kind of search for the right answer, even if they don't find it straight away and just go from there and hopefully make it very fun for him in this way. So today I'm just going to show you a little bit what we've been doing in the meantime and then we have the saddle there so if he is going to be okay enough then we might do the same things with them with the saddle. Yesterday actually was a really good moment because I was practicing with this and this was actually the first time when he really tried to search for the relaxation when things were a little bit difficult so he was putting his head down he was still focusing I did some turns and made it kind of fun so we're just going to pick up where we left yesterday going to see how that will go and then uh, hopefully we get a bit further. So what I really like to do myself always with the horses to make it a bit more my own work. To really ask things and then to just really reward when they find the right thing. You, Good boy. You can see this is already a bit better. Yeah. So I did a bit of this in the last few times. He's not too bothered anymore. Yeah, and he is here already. He's already kind of putting his head down. Of course also playing with his rope because he's champ. So now I'm just gonna make some sound again. I'm gonna see if what he did yesterday, yeah. That he puts his head down instead of trying to be kind of tensed. This is already so much better. Like yesterday he just really had a moment where he understood. And it was a really mo nice moment. And now he's just playing with the rope. Oh. Also not gonna put too much attention to it, but I'm on the rope back. Shh. thinking and now I want him to find it even when it a bit it's a little bit harder that he could really puts his head down <laughs> all the other horses are reacting he's waiting he can find it yeah good boy wow such a good boy, yeah, such a good boy. And then what, something else I did is touching him, him again while walking. Good. Asking a few things to go a bit sideways. Good. And then I'm gonna just change some directions, make it a bit fun. Yeah. And it was a bit harder for him to turn to his um, right side. That's okay. Yeah, good boy. So what I really like to do is always to really, 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 really reward when he's doing the right thing. <laughs> yeah, oh, careful for your own legs. Good boy. And the other way again, just easy. Yeah, oh, it's okay. Good. good boy. And then I ignore it kind of and ask it again. Off. Yeah, good so. Really good. Good boy, seeing if I can touch him, yeah, good, good, okay, super, all the way again, in a relaxed way, yeah, you also have a lot of legs, and long legs, and here you see, and the wind came into the plastic, so he was a little bit more worried, but he didn't really react too crazy. Yeah, good. <laughs> My arm will be cramping soon. <laughs> you can find it. Ooh. Made up the frustration again. Almost. Good boy. Wow. Yeah. Good boy. Oh. <laughs> Turning. Good. We haven't done the trot yet. Good. And I just walk with him as I would be doing 
if I do the kind of trick training, liberty work, come here. Well, I want them to be together with me. Come. Yeah, and he is also a little bit careful because I don't want him in my neck. So I, of course, also yeah want him to be gentle. But then he also needs to know that he can trot, just not too fast. Ooh, he Good boy. Go away. Yeah. Yeah. Easy. Good boy. Good boy. And I always like to see when I am being positive and rewarding them that they kind of get more proud. You see him looking. Ew. It's okay. Yeah. Good boy. Boy. Alright, so just a few more things to see if I can, for example, let him go sideways. And then that gives me kind of a chance to let him know when he's doing something really good. Instead of only telling him what he shouldn't be doing. Yeah, good. Right. Good boy. Good boy. And this is ooh, these are also really good things. Um, by just asking something, but also as I would do when I'm doing the liberty work and the trick training, yeah. Um, to just ask things to be able to reward him. But it's also good for him to know things can be asked without his head kind of being too full. Hoot. Stand wall. Yeah. Deze kant. This way. Yeah, I think so. Good boy. Yeah, he is. Good boy. Good boy. Wow. <laughs> Easy. E yeah. Woo. Good boy. Little snacks. Okay, so I think that's really good. He's really trying and it's nice to just ask things, being able to reward him. Also know that some of the things you need to ask can be a bit smaller to be able to give him a good feeling. And then we build from there. I'm just going to put the saddle on, see how that will go. It will be the first time. Of course he knows the saddle, but just for us the first time. And then uh, we're going to do the same things and see how, he, how his head will be the same or if he will change a bit. You have a really nice saddle cloth. Beautiful color. I like purple. Maybe this is a little too purple for me, but I like it. And I'm just going to do it all very chill, easy. If the wind doesn't blow the pen away. Good boy. And in that way he can show me as well uh, his true reaction and feelings. To be careful, it's a nice new saddle. Need them. Oh. Good boy. Looks like I'd, it's the first time I'm taking up a horse. <laughs> I can assure you it's not. Okay, and again with the saddle maybe he doesn't care at all because of course he knows it and maybe he doesn't have any bad memories to it but we'll figure it out we'll see it's interesting to find out this is champ with a saddle on <laughs> let's see we're just gonna walk I really try my best to I'm just gonna see what he will do. Boy. Good. Also, if his reaction will be different than the normal things. Okay, for now, he doesn't really seem to react. Let me do the same trot. And he's a bit not so sure. Come on. Yeah, good boy. Now you could, I don't know if you could hear a moan. That can mean that there will be a reaction soon. Come on. He's not as confident yet. Yeah, good boy. And he doesn't really know if he should be moving. And I will show him. Yeah. Woo. Good boy. Just a little moment. You can draw on good boy. Oh, now you see him getting a bit stiff. Yeah, it's okay. So he's definitely reacting a little bit on the girth or the saddle. He doesn't really want to 
do his normal thing. Yeah, I'm just gonna let him move through it. Good. Ah, good boy. Yeah, good boy. Till he gets the same fun feeling as before. Yeah, wow, good. So you can see, you behaved really well. Nothing too crazy. He's a bit more careful and a bit moaning and not too sure if he should be trotting. Um, but he's trying to get through that. So that's the most important. Okay. This way. Yeah, good boy. Good boy. Here, what we did in the first few times where we had a little start of getting him a bit softer. You can now try to do that here too. Yeah. So also sometimes when you reward the horse when they're excited, they get even more excited. Yeah. Good boy. And what I like about doing these circles is that he really will focus on my body. So if I want to go fast, I show. Yeah. And when I want to go slower, my whole body goes a bit slower. Good. Good boy. You're such a good boy. Now we put the stirrups down. Can have a bit more that touches him. First, gonna start easy again like this. See if I can make him move a bit more sideways or bigger. Yeah. And all of this will take a lot of time. Also with the, if you do normally the liberty work, which of course is kind of similar as when you just working with the halter because you want to be able to do everything without that eventually. Um, good. But it's good to see how we're gonna go. Yeah. Good. And then you will see soon if I will pet his neck. Sometimes then you get a bit more reaction. Yeah. Then I'm gonna run as well. Good. Boy. Good. You see he's doing really good because he still has a bit of tension. Right, so slowing down, get faster, yeah. Easy slowing down. Good boy. Good boy. And they yeah. They see if I run, it's a bit more of a trigger. Yeah. Good boy. Good boy. Trying to see if he can use his body here. You also see when it's a bit more tense. Then his whole body, you will see it in his movement. Ah, good boy. Yeah. <laughs> But I do feel like we're a bit more on a point where we can be playing with this. Like now, <laughs> you see when I touch him, he's starting to kind of dance, do a bit different things, but not to the point where it's too much. Yeah, just making a bit of noise on the saddle. Then I'm going to use just kind of, yeah, the stairs and pedestal to act like I'm getting on. I'm not getting on yet, of course. We have a few more steps to go and things to do. I haven't done it too many times again, but the first thing is to see if I can ask him kind of to park for in case he wants to turn away. And I'm going to see if with the whip I can ask him to park and kind of come in because he always had a bit of problem standing still. So then I can see, yeah, good if I can use this. Yeah, good boy when I'm on the pedestal. Just going to act very normal. Now I'm also big, not only you. Yeah, good boy. And just patting him, good boy. Don't push me off, please. Circle. Okay, then here I'm gonna ask if he understands and he can turn to me instead of walk. Ooh. To kind of give him his own feeling of control too. In. Oh. Easy. Anyway, this is always a fun thing to work on. 
because now it always looks a bit difficult. But then when you get, get one step in a good direction and you let them know, then it kind of goes quick. So even though he might think it's difficult, the only thing I'm searching for here right now is that he would just make one step into my direction. So then I can let him know straight away how good it was and that was all I meant. And in this way he can just learn that we ask little things. It doesn't really matter if he gets it or if he doesn't really get it. But then it's fun to work it out together. And now I just take a step back, go on the floor first for how he knows it a bit more. One little step and that's already enough. Ask it one more time. And then you see he gets it straight away really, really good. Little treat, of course. Then I go back on the pedestal and you see he picks it up straight away. So it's kind of easy in a way if you just focus on the positive little steps and then once he gets it, you just let him know and then he gets it. So here I only have to point and he already goes again. So I just want him to like feel like he can do it and that he likes it as well. And we can just use that and take it further for whenever we want to or need to and just for him to enjoy it as well. Then he did a few good times. Then I always try to do it all over again. So I kind of try to make it difficult. Like I start from the beginning or I put the horse in a more difficult position. So then when he finds it, it's already a little bit harder, but very good when he does. And here he really gets the idea straight away. And then of course, for lots of cuddles. Let's put this one somewhere else, change it up a bit. Oopsie. <laughs> okay. Oh, <laughs> and now he's nearly getting on my lap. Yeah. Well done. Good boy. Good boy. Ooh. Yeah. Yeah, good so. So then here I think I will finish this video. He did really well. It was already a very different feeling for me with him. Of course, we're getting to know each other a little bit better as well. Um, but I feel like we reached a bit of a point where he wants to try and where I understand him a little bit more. So we're gonna keep practicing and we'll see you in the next video. So thank you for watching, bearing with us, and I'll see you there. Bye-bye.